Indian Navy warships undertook successful multiple BrahMos anti-ship missile firings to revalidate and demonstrate readiness for long-range precision offensive strike. After conducting Exercise Akraman in Central Sector, the Indian Air Force will launch Exercise Dhruv Tara from 5th May. The Mechanized Forces of Indian Army's Battle Axe Division conducted an exercise to validate battlefield drills in deserts of Rajasthan. The Indian government has asked social media users and news media outlets to refrain from live coverage of defense operations and movement of security forces that might inadvertently help hostile elements. Pakistan Air Force has released an image showcasing its JF-17 Block III fighter jet equipped with 145 km range PL-15 missiles for the first time. The ISRO successfully conducted a short-duration hot test of the semi-cryogenic engine, that operated up to 60% of its rated power level, demonstrating stable and controlled performance. In a big revelation regarding India's AMCA program, the director of the gas turbine research establishment has confirmed that the proposed sixth-generation jet engine for the AMCA 5.5-generation aircraft will deliver a maximum thrust of 120 kN, and not 110 kN as widely reported in the media. The upgraded thrust level indicates enhanced performance characteristics such as higher supercruise capability, better acceleration and climb rate, high altitude combat, improved payload capacity and better agility. The 120 kN engine in twin engine configuration will generate 240 kN, and with the more powerful jet engines, the AMCA can use lower throttle settings during cruising, reducing infrared signature and increasing stealth, and will also help in future proofing the AMCA, and boost the export appeal of the platform. Under a 300 crore rupees contract signed in August 2023, Noida-based defense startup Veda Aeronautics has commenced delivery of 200 Shuri Shastra Mark I jet-powered catapult-launched swarm drone to the Indian Air Force. The drone is 3.5 meters long and has a 3-meter wingspan, and has an explosive warhead payload. It weighs nearly 90 kilograms fully loaded, and has a range of over 150 kilometers, and its swarm capability will allow coordinated strikes with multiple drones to overwhelm enemy air defenses. The Indian Air Force issued a request for information for the procurement of three high-altitude platform systems, that will provide continuous surveillance over strategic areas, such as India's borders with Pakistan and China, and the Indian Ocean region. It will be capable of loitering for up to 45 days, and will deliver real-time imagery, target identification and detection, addressing critical needs for long-term weapons planning and battlefield awareness. Today's top 3 comments 